is not financially st- uh, you know sound yeah but i was with my my ex girlfriend and we we're just talking and we we're like drink we still drink me and my ex we were like thinking at our house and they were like where can we go but there's no fucking place to go like there's no it's just to the bars and then home like mm-hmm. Namibia has Foco and I was like oh public art oh public art and August 2019 is where everything changed I said there's no fucking public art in Namibia okay August 2019 so the people who are listening to this don't fucking say Damn, yeah, I should be fancy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, so this is this is coming back to why I'm pissed today. Yeah, yeah. It's coming back to why I'm pissed today. But I'm yeah, talk about it. Yeah, right. yeah don't worry. <laughs> in phrases, in phrases, in code, you know, yeah, nigga yeah. code. I got you. <laughs> so uh, I got that shit registered like ASAP, man. I mm-hmm. went to people 2020, February, January. Put the papers together, bro. Like concept, like is it feasible? Is it feasible? how is it gonna work? Again, it was just me in my room now. Yeah. Just me in my room now. Listening to two albums, um, Michael Kiwanuka's um, Kiwanuka album mm-hmm. and Unknown Unknown Mortal Orchestra number two, album two. Those two albums I listened to for a period of like two months in my room at three o'clock in the morning, every fucking morning, putting together the, the, the paperwork for what I think is a feasible idea, which is public art. Mm-hmm. I'll never forget that shit. Because I was just a nigger in a room. And everyone will say, oh, you're a business guy now, you're a founder, you don't know what we struggle through and shit like that. Oh, matter, I know those three o'clock mornings. Yeah, those. I know those mornings, mm-hmm. bro. So then I got it registered, and then COVID hit. February, boom, mm. COVID, crazy. But I put the team together. I got two architects, I got a project manager, I got a brand ambassador, I got a social media person in that year. Started slowly emailing businesses and shit like, is this a good idea? Like, would you give us like a recommendation, Shandy? Mm. Let uh, Dololo were the only motherfuckers that gave me a recommendation to say this is a good idea. Shout out to them. Though. Shout out to Dololo. Yeah, they're actually looking out for the dreamers. Word, word, word. And the, uh, I'm sorry, is I. There's no other way to describe him, but the owner or the founder mm-hmm. um, is a white guy, tall white guy. Mm-hmm. I saw him in a bar once, and somebody said, that's the guy. And mm-hmm. I was like, oh, shit, I was supposed to f- say hello to him, mm-hmm. say thank you, because he signed off on that letter. Nice. Um, yeah, so I took the idea to City of Vintuk as well. They told me they don't have a public art policy. All the politics, the politics went and went. 2021 comes. Mm-hmm. No, the end of 2020 comes. So now let me go into definition art. Sorry for the people that were like, when is this nigga going to talk about definition art? Man? Yeah, it's happening now. Because <laughs> I'm also just laying back, <laughs> just listening. <laughs> so so yeah. I want, we wanted to do, uh, what is this? Murals at the mall. Mm. Mara mall. That, that would have been dope. It's still going to happen. Still really? might happen. Still in process? Happen. Yeah, the, it's still in process. Yeah, okay. the, the walls are still there. So we said Yeah 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 Hey Hey Type of lifestyle that we living over here is not the same People say they never gon' change but they change Times are moving faster ain't no time to switch a lane Keep me out of range They say nothing strange Load my ammo in my clip and I go ham beat 